around the virus, it was it was it was just making sure that you were fully you were, you had full vision on what was going on in your business. Yep. And you also had to had to anticipate what the government was going to do around restricting what um, you could do with your business. If you could be as vigilant and as focused over for the, that you have been over the last 10 months you know, in a better economy, um, mm. then we all should be better off. G'day, Lou from Elgas here again. Today I'm going to talk about the year that's nearly finished and what a year it was. What a massive challenge for business uh, that the COVID virus was this year. Uh, it all started uh, back in, well, we don't really know when it started, maybe November last year, but it impacted on Western Australia most significantly from March onwards. That's when there was a lot of uncertainty. Uh, businesses saw that uh, there was lots of risk coming in front of them. There was cash flow challenges. There was, everything was really thrown at us around this COVID virus, safety for employees, um, and, and just remaining in business was probably the biggest concern. Um, the government then pumped a whole lot of money into the economy and for some that's been absolutely fantastic. For others who didn't quite qualify, their business was still uh, severely impacted but not quite enough. Um, so look, there was a bit of hit and miss in that but I think by and large what the government did was appropriate. Uh, I think for Western Australia probably more than appropriate. Uh, it provided um, a lot of stimulus into the economy and allowed businesses then to think about how they were going to manage the COVID virus the way through the rest of this year. And it was very challenging. It meant that a lot of businesses had to be far more vigilant on their numbers and far more progressive with their HR policies, especially around employee safety and uh, working either in the office or at home, and usually a mixture of both. So a really, really challenging year, very, very stressful year. For some of us, massive workload. For others, they didn't know what they were going to do next because their businesses had been shut down uh, by the government. So, look, it couldn't have been a year of much more change than we had, and I think the businesses that have come out the other side of this um, would be in better shape than um, going forward into next year. There might be some cash flow hurdles in the interim to get through, but I think by and large, um, if we see a, an improved economy next year, and I think we will in Western Australia with the building industry really starting to take off, the mining industry is continuing on to be strong, um, then we'll have set our businesses up to be far more resilient and far better placed into 2021. And I think we've got every reason to be really, really optimistic about next year. If you'd like some help with any of that, please give us a call at Elgas. Cheers.